the Gun Broker Range Bag. Let's check it out. Today we're going to take a look at my range gear, uh, especially when I'm like going to the range with a number of handguns uh, to do reviews or you know if I'm going to do a defensive class, something where I need to get a lot of gear in a small package and I can carry it, it has everything I need right here at my fingertips. This is an extra large range bag from gunbroker.com. Uh, they got in touch with me, I guess they've been <laughs> watching some of my range bags and they said we want to send you this bag. And so I thought, I'll take a look at it, see what it is, and uh, go ahead and fill it up with the things that I normally take. And I'll tell you what, guys, I've been using this now for about a month, and uh, it's really great. I'm able to keep everything together. I'm not forgetting stuff, which has typically been my MO. <laughs> I'm always leaving something at home. And uh, this is a great little bag. I'll tell you right now, this is a very affordable bag. I think they run $69.99 on Gunbroker. Uh, you can go down to the bottom of the page and they have their gun broker store, which I didn't even realize. Uh, but they have a number of items, but this is one thing that they do offer. Now, one thing I love about this bag is the size. Um, I have some smaller range bags. They work fine for a lot of applications if I'm just going for a quick trip. But if I'm really going, especially if I'm doing something like a self-defense class or competitive shooting, or, you know, for me, I take a lot of guns to the range uh, for review. So a bag like this is just a great size. Uh, you've got a nice, good, solid grab handle, and these are stitched all the way down the inside, and you'll be able to see it through the pockets once we get them open. Uh, but this is a good, solid grip. The bag is really nice and large, so you really need this grip. It's 21 inches in width, it's 13 and a half inches in depth, and it's 10 inches high. Of course, it's 600 Kodura, and it is black. Uh, we'll look at the inside. It is tan, which I love that kind of contrast. Now, there are five outer pockets. You've got a large pocket here. Uh, you've got two side pockets. One's a little bit abbreviated right here because you want to have your water bottle, space for your water bottle. And then over here, we have a larger pocket, and it does have a place right here where you can put an ID patch or something to identify the bag. Then here on the back, you have two pockets that are large enough these are nine inches tall, eight inches wide, and two inches deep. Now, because you can fit a lot in here, especially ammo, it gets heavy. You do have a shoulder strap. It is padded. Uh, it has swivels right here, but this is easy to release. It does have metal D-rings, which I love. Of course, you can take this shoulder strap and stick it back in the bag, and it keeps it handy. But uh, good, solid fixtures on the bag. We have rubberized pulls, and we can open this up get it open. Uh, on this side right here, I have some miscellaneous items. I have a cloth, some earplug hearing protection. Uh, one thing that I've been doing lately is carrying some of this lead off. This stuff is great, especially if you're handling a lot of ammunition. But it's nice and large to where you can get a lot of gear packed in here. And see on the outer side, you have the tan sleeve. The inside is black. Uh, but again, here's your strap coming down and it really solidifies this pack. Uh, there are some elastic keepers here, and uh, I can slip pins, things like that. Now, they are fairly small, so you're going to have to be careful what you put in here. It doesn't give you a lot of larger area, but definitely things like pins and smaller items can fit down in here to be very organized. Here in the other pouch, very similar, and this is where I keep all my cleaning kit stuff. Uh, I do keep a cleaning rod just in case I have any kind of squib or anything like that. Sometimes you need to clear your bore. So it's great to have a cleaning rod, and this one is one of the military cleaning rod kits, so it packs very nicely and it fits right here in this pouch. Have some screwdrivers and have some brake free, some other oils. And one thing I definitely keep around is one of the Brownells Magna Tips. Uh, this is made for gunsmithing, and so I keep a number of these little bits in there. Also, I have one of the gun tools, and this is just an awesome tool. Uh, I've just started using it, but it has a lot of different features. 
where you can use this for a multitude of reasons. There's nothing worse than being out at the range and you know your scope ring's coming loose or you need to tighten up something and this gives you an all-in-one tool. I think these are also available on GunBroker. In fact, it has a little thing at the back here where you have bits for screwdriver. So, uh, and then you can place them right here in the tip. So this is a great little tool in itself. Now here's your front pouch. Uh, we have gun broker stitched right into the bag, double pulls. This is excellent. You got a lot of room for magazines. I believe there are eight magazine holders here. Then here in the front of the lid, you have a place to put all kind of different items. You can slip down into this. This is the elastic type keeper. Uh, it has different sizes, which really I like. Uh, it's a lot larger here. And then of course for pens and smaller items there. But you do have that color that really brings this out. It makes a good contrast. And then here in the back we have a, just an open sleeve and uh, I've got some targets back there but you can slip targets or whatever you want to in the back. Plus you can actually put more items down under here to be able to hold this together. Now on the side here of course we have our place to put our water bottle and then again double pulls on every pouch. Open this up. I have my iPro, EarPro, things that I just need to get to and uh, you know it's just got a lot of room right here. Then here on the other side double pulls again you got the color difference here. In fact I just didn't slip anything in here but you can throw your strap in here. I mean it just gives you a lot of options whatever you carry. Now these are the things though that I carry and this is one bag that we did take to the range and these were the items that were in it. Uh, here on the top velcroed together so this thing stays in one piece. The top Double zippers, got a nice flap, it's velcroed so it's not going to come loose. This is a nice large main compartment and there's some features in here that I really like. Uh, for one thing, uh, it does have a caddy and we can pull this caddy out all together. And so that way it's an ammo caddy or whatever you're carrying. So it gives you a really good option. It's got good strong handles that go all the way down and through. In fact, all of the pouches are padded so it's going to give you some protection. Here are the ammo caddy. It has that cl closed foam padding here. Uh, so I've got my foam action sports. These things, they weigh two ounces. If you see me shooting a rifle, you will see this on video. This comes with me to every range trip. Uh, then I can put all the different ammo in here. Um, and of course, Fioki, big sponsor of the ammo. I love it. It's great shooting stuff made right here in the USA. So you can see I've got quite a bit of ammo in there. I've got my holster advanced holster for my Hudson. Then I have magazine caddies as well on either side so I can put six additional magazines on top of the eight that I have in that front pouch. And then they have these sleeves inside. Now these have Velcro so if I want to kind of divide this up, let's say I have nine millimeter and 40 or whatever or even three different types of ammo. I can put this, make a divider, bring this in, make a divider, And so now I've got three different compartments, still have my magazines, still retains it. There's also metal D-rings on either side, so I can actually attach that shoulder strap to this if I want to set my range bag down, go to a loading table, everything's laid out. I mean, it's just a lot of cool options. And the strap goes all the way through, and it actually goes all the way around. And if I don't want to use the dividers, I can put them in the bottom here, or I can slip them in one of the other pouches, just keeps them handy. And in here I've got about 500 rounds of ammo, the six mags, my uh, foam action sports rest, and it's all in here. Plenty of room, grab it and go. Also, there are two really nice gun rugs or gun cases. Uh, these have zippers. You can fire, put your firearm in here. What I really like about these pouches is the inside has this really soft material, so it's gonna protect the finish of your firearm. Uh, and you can slip it in here, it kind of separates it. It's one of the things about some range bags, if you're not careful, you took, put two or three guns in here, they can bump around, and that's one thing you don't want, especially with this Hudson <laughs> H9. It's not an inexpensive firearm. And here again, another pouch. Have my CZ SP01. And then on each side, there's a padded sleeve as well. And inside there, you can also put different firearms, whatever you're taking to the range. So really comfortably, you can put four firearms in here that are well protected away from anything else. And then you've got a nice large area. If you decide not to carry your ammo caddy, you've got a lot of room in here to pack things in. 
And I love the contrast again with the tan on the black. So guys, if you're looking for a range bag that doesn't break the bank, and yet it has a lot of different features, I think this is a great bag to go with. Again, $69.99 on the Gun Broker website. Um, you know, just get out of the bottom of the page. Of course, I can't put any links uh, on the, in the description, uh, but it's easy enough to find. But it's their extra large range bag, and uh, with all the pockets being padded, it protects your firearms, gives you a lot of uh, organizational possibilities, and uh, just makes a great companion for the range. Be strong, be of good courage. God bless America, long live the Republic. $30 that it won't. Oh! I, I bet you $30 it will. <laughs> Refreshing. The gun broker range bag makes this much better. <laughs>